Peace. My name is Marlanda DeKine, also known as Sapien Soul. I am speaking to you from Plannersville, South Carolina. Thank you to Georgetown County Libraries and to Kwame Dawes for permission to share the following poems. Tornado Child by Kwame Dawes for Rosalie Richardson. I am a tornado child. I come like a swirl of black and darken up your day. I whip it all into my womb, lift you and your things, carry you to where you've never been, and maybe, if I feel good, I might bring you back, all warm and scared, heart humming wild like a bird after early sudden flight. I am a tornado child. I tremble at the elements. When thunder rolls, my womb trembles, remembering the tweak of contractions that tightened to a wail when my mother pushed me out into the black of a tornado night. I am a tornado child. You can tell us from far by the crazy of our hair. Couldn't tame it if we tried. Even now, I tie a bandana to silence the din of anarchy in these core, thick plaits. I am a tornado child, born in the world of clouds. The center crumbled, then I came. My lovers know the blast of my chaotic giving. They tremble at the whip of my supple thighs. You cross me at your peril. I I swallow light when the warm of anger lashes me into a spin the pine trees bend to me swept in my gyrations i am a tornado child when the spirit takes my head i hurtle into the vacuum of white sheets billowing and paint a swirl of color streaked with my many songs at anchor the real situation for bob marley Bavaria, November 1980. Here is the brilliant morning on a fishing boat. This is the dream a dying man has in midwinter. The world covered in light and shadow. He dreams of St. Anne's Bay, of the murmur of soft waves. The sea is familiar as all dawns are familiar. We walk into them knowing it is our sack of troubles that we spill open to color the sky. But here on the boat, at anchor, apart from the ordinary lull of the easy tide, there is a certain peace. He cannot know that in six months the weight of locked wool on his shoulders will be lifted, that in the soft gloom of a German chalet in deep January he will anticipate with terror his death, rewriting his theology of eternity, shadowed by the swirling clouds, the bickering sycophants, the friends who will not stop to pray, frightened as they are by the end of the crusade the last triumphant march through the world's plaza where the faithful milanese one hundred thousand strong stand beatific under the benediction of brutalizing music and here he already knows that his last songs convey the weight of a man sitting on the sea staring out into the slithering metallic green and imagining his words as prayers this is the burden a poet must carry with him to the sea the burden for a truth unfettered by the promise of another morning. The sea is a continuous tomorrow, so unremarkable that it becomes an exquisite now. What a lofty standard of truth it is for a poem. A way of seeing. It all comes from this dark dirt. Memory is casual as a laborer. Remembrances of ancestors kept in trinkets, tiny remains that would madden anthropologists with their namelessness. No records, just smells of stories passing through most tenuous links, trusting in the birthing of seed from seed. This calabash bowl of great grand Martha, born a slave's child. This bundle of socks, unused thick woolen things for the snow. He died, Uncle Felix, before the ship pushed off the Kingston Wharf, nosing for winter, for London. He never used the socks, just had them buried with him. So, sometimes forgetting the panorama, these poems focus like a tunnel to a way of seeing time past, a way of seeing the dead. Landho. I cannot speak the languages spoken in that vessel, cannot read the beads promising salvation. 
I know this only, that when the green of land appeared like light after the horror of this crossing, we straightened our backs and faced the simplicity of new days with flame. I know I have the blood of survivors coursing through my veins. I know the lament of our loss must warm us again and again down in the belly of the whale, here in the belly of this whale where we are still searching for homes. We sing laments so old, so true, then straighten our backs again. Thank you, Kwame. Peace, 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 peace. Everyone be well.